Okay, let's speak about a really a discouraging topic. The battery saving. Well, battery saving entered uh, into Android in a very dramatic way starting from Android 6. Before uh, it was not so much terrible, after it became terrible in the sense that it be with not so much advantage uh, it started uh, killing the service app without a particular reason so the service app just like mine uh, are killed by this uh, battery saving procedure without a particular reason and this is really discouraging for me uh, a lot of times uh, people uh, accuse my app uh, uh, not to work anymore after some time but the true the true reason is the battery saving procedure installed on their smartphone some smartphones are worse than others in general Chinese smartphones have a very terrible battery saving procedure in the sense that they are the real killers of service app well uh, I have identified some uh, work around some settings to be operated uh, they are not all the, so I'm sure that the, I haven't identified all the uh, needed settings because uh, there are uh, hundred, uh, thousands of thousands of, uh, mm, of models of smartphone that uh, everyone can have its settings uh, settings are different uh, now i will illustrate to you some sentence that i have identified but of course you have to use your fantasy and you have to look for on the internet to find the setting you need on your smartphone okay but in general now i will teach you what i have uh, found in my in my search okay well first of all First of all, uh, the first suggestion is automatic. It will appear uh, in uh, the help, uh, automatically uh, helping you. Uh, and you can find it in the topic, uh, in the help topic, standby and those. Okay, here are some notes uh, and you can press the remove button to go to the ignore battery optimization section. This is the section that you have to reach in the case that my app is not able to find this page because in some, <laughs> unfortunately, in some smartphone this page does not exist or is different anyway. Okay, you have to put, of course, all apps. You have to look for my app is a free notification reader. As you can see, is not allow it to ignore battery. You have to allow it to ignore battery. I repeat, uh, the statement can be different on your smartphone. You have to uh, eliminate battery saving procedure from my app. Okay, so now it's allow it to consume to more drain your battery more quickly. It's not important. The important thing is that my app can survive well let's go on so now uh, another another possible settings sometimes uh, in some smartphone it can be enough some other really not you, you must go to battery to battery there is launch for example i repeat it can be different on your smartphone but you have to find something similar on launch you have to find the free notification reader okay here it is yes not manually not excuse me not automatic manage manually so launch and running background are managed by the app and not by battery saving procedure so now you can see it's managed manually and my app is upstairs <laughs> for notification region manage manually okay last but not least anyway this is i hope it's not a uh, need for you but in some case it needed notification and status bar notification to no screen in this way uh, you oblige the system to remember that uh, he has to do something when a notification arrives uh, it can be useful of course there is uh, the problem that uh, your uh, display is lit every time a notification arrives 
but uh, this can be of some help in the case that the battery saving procedure is really hard. Okay, bye.